Daniel chapter 7 verses 13 and 14. His kingdom shall not be destroyed. As the visions during the night continued, I saw one like a son of man coming, on the clouds of heaven, when he reached the ancient one and was presented before him, the one like a son of man received dominion, glory and kingship, all peoples, nations and languages serve him. His dominion is an everlasting dominion that shall not be taken away, his kingship shall not be destroyed. As we study the Bible, we notice that each time the word cloud is used it is associated with majesty and the awesome presence of God. God's glory appeared in a cloud in Exodus 16:10 and 19:9 at the giving of the law at Sinai. The Son of Man therefore is the Messiah, Jesus Christ. Jesus himself uses this phrase to identify himself in Matthew, Luke and John. The Son of Man is brought into the presence of the Ancient One. The expression in Aramaic literally means advanced in days, but this is not intended to suggest that God ages, He is a spirit, and does not age as a human would. At this point the Son of Man, Jesus, is given all authority, glory, sovereignty and power over all peoples, nations and men. Notice the phrase, Son of Man coming, on the clouds of heaven, is a reference to Jesus, the Son of God. In the Old Testament, especially in Ezekiel we see the title Son of Man, used 90 times in reference to Ezekiel. Daniel 7:13. we know that the term Son of Man, is in reference to Jesus because this Son of Man, came on the clouds from heaven.